confused. Yeah. In love with Madison. Um, yeah, I think confu I mean, I think the thing that you have to really, like, that was very interesting about Troy is that, and the thing that I really loved about playing him is, like, he hasn't had any contact with human beings before this. And so when you watch him, you're, he's learning as he's going how relationships, how, you know, he's having his adolescence at the same time as everybody is already, you know, in a, an apocalypse. So his brain is just taking on so much information. So he, he comes out in these very confusing ways. But I thought that was a really interesting way of writing a character who has not been integrated into society and is learning how those things, how those things work. And when, you know, he's constantly pushing boundaries, not because he loves pushing boundaries, but just doesn't know how far certain things go. And so I think the confusing aspect of it is just somebody who's like, oh, that reaction, you know, that reaction produces this, and, or this happens when I do that. And I think that's always a, a joy to play. He, I do a podcast about all things Walking Dead, and I think uh, Troy, you could say, has some psychotic tendencies. I don't know if you would say that. But some of the you could say that. <laughs> but there are plenty of listeners who would write in in support of Troy because you just played it so damn charmingly, and I want to know how you feel about it. You must have gotten some feedback like that, right? Yeah, I mean, I think people really relate to the idea of like, of course, he arrives on the scene and he feels like this very malevolent, you know, thing. But I think, as Kevin said, like, all, people are just people. You know, the the, the grayness of people comes in the fact that they are both aspects, you know, nobody is born evil and nobody is entirely evil. There are really big aspects that, you know, that, that they just subverted in some way. And um, and so that's always a really interesting thing is, is that people kind of go, oh, I relate to that. Being misunderstood, I relate to that. Or, um, or you know, I, I, I love someone so much that I don't know how to show them that. You know, people relate to those things really heavily. And so I think that's why what, what people loved about him. You could see some vulnerability there sometimes. For sure, like, you know, he's, he's really broken, but he's, you know, he's still working it out at the same time. Amazing. Hi, next. Hello. 